Hello everyone, I'm Big Al with Country Music News International and we are here in Nashville for CRS and certainly have already talked with a lot of great people. Sitting over here with me, first of all, I want to thank the sergeant for his service in keeping our country free, but they also entertain and they have the group Six String Soldiers. And Sergeant Boron is the man and the speaker for these guys, or at least he is right now. We're going to try to pull some secrets out of him. Sergeant, uh -oh. Uh -oh. thank you for being on Country Music News. Our pleasure. Thanks for having me. And thanks thank for, you for your me. service. My pleasure. Our pleasure. So, what came about? Uh, you're in the service. Yes. Five other guys. What was you in the barracks one night? You get to talking and singing, and something comes out of that. So, give us a little history on Six String Soldiers. Well, you know, it actually there is some truth to that. Now, so. Backing up, I joined the military 16 and a half years ago, and I joined to pay for med school. So that was my, originally my goal was to become a doctor and then, and then probably serve in the military as a doctor. So I joined, and at the time I joined, I was, uh, you know, I'd just done a lot of school, you can imagine. And uh, so I was looking for a break, something exciting to do. My father was in the military, so I thought this is a great opportunity for me to take a break serve my country, do something exciting and fun, and they also uh, helped me pay for my education. Sure. So I joined immediately right out of the gate. Somebody noticed that I had a background in music, so they asked if I was interested in, in serving my country by playing music. I actually went to Germany originally and played with the U.S. Army Europe Band. Uh, that was right out of the gate. That was my first assignment. And... You know, at the time, I still intended on going back to school and all that. Well, life works the way life works, and here I am 16 years later doing the same thing. Now, in the meantime, I auditioned and, and got a position with a band out of D.C., the U.S. Army Field Band. Mm -hmm. And the field band has been around since the 40s uh, with a similar mission that we have today, which is to reach out to the folks thank folks for their service, thank our veterans, and, and just put a positive face with the uniform. And so I was fortunate to, uh, to, to, to get this audition and, 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 and get, be a part of the, the United States Army Field Band. We saw, we saw this need to be able to go in to like our veterans' homes and have a smaller, a smaller footprint. And so, so some friends of mine, some colleagues, we, we kind of formed this acoustic group, the Six String Soldiers, and it was really just kind of for fun. And we would, so we would go into veterans' hospitals and, and, and schools and stuff and, and, and just, just reach out in a more intimate setting, a smaller setting. Well, we started doing videos online, and you can check us out on, on all of our Instagram and Facebook and all that, Six String Soldiers. We started doing these videos for fun on the side of the road yeah. or on a snowbank, <laughs> and they blew up. Viral videos. Long story short, eventually this became the band, the official, the official group, and we've gone on to do late night shows, and we've played with with some of the biggest names in the music industry, and and here we are at Country Radio Seminar, just <laughs> networking and meeting folks to further our mission, which is to get out, thank our vets, thank the 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 public and the world for their support for for what we do, and all of our brothers and sisters in the military, and so here we are today. Here doing this are. and here I am 16 never went to med school sorry mom but uh, I'm doing what I love and serving my country doing it too well wait a minute though maybe you didn't need to go to med school to be able to comfort people and heal them up because music heals the soul that is you know right that, that is right I do I do and I've I've like I said I've had the uh, opportunity the, the army has afforded me the opportunity to I, I've played for Iraqi citizens in Iraq, soldiers, and you know we can't communicate with words, but you play music and 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 you can communicate that way, and and like you said, heal, and you know I like I I've been I've been stationed all over the world, and and I've played all over our country here, and you're absolutely right, you're absolutely right, it does, it is. It is good for the soul. Look at you. You're positive. You're happy. Your life is in order. You're serving your country. I'm and you're trying. People with music. You and five other guys. Yes, yes, and a couple of gals too. We have a uh, we have a uh, fabulous new singer that uh, uh, Staff Sergeant Brownie, if she happens to be watching. She was in the Marines, 
uh, came over to the Army and now is singing with us. So we're very excited for the, the you know the future with her. And uh, yeah, it's just it's just a pleasure for us to do what we do and to serve you fine folks out there. You've got some music coming out. We're, we always have music coming out. We're, we're constantly, uh, constantly putting out new music, and uh, we have one of the reasons we're here is we're networking with artists. We would like to do collaborations with artists that you know uh, maybe have a connection with the military. Maybe they themselves serve, as, as a lot of the audience out there knows. The, there are some just fabulous, huge. You know, legends in the music industry that also served, yeah. and, and so we're reaching out to those folks to do collaborations and and hear their story uh, and how the military has has affected their life and, and and touched their life, and then play some music too. So that's our latest project that we're working on. But we're always we're always uh, working on new music, and and you can find a lot of it on our social media platforms as well. Sergeant, thank you so much. Thank you so much for being too. on Country Music News International, and thank you for your service. Our pleasure. Our we really appreciate it. Our pleasure, and thank you all out there, too. Thank you. We've been talking with Sergeant Boron from the United States Army. Six string soldiers, look them up. They're all over the country. And to know more about other country and bluegrass music, you can always check out countrymusicnewsinternational.com. We're here at CRS in Nashville once again. Thank you for your service, Sergeant Boron, and the other members of your team, and the whole veterans in the United States Army and everybody in the military. So, uh, everybody have a great day. I'm Big Al Weekly for, C uh, for Country Music News International. <laughs>